Well, all right then. Corey Lindsley, centre for the Chargers. Top 100 players in 2022. Comes in at number 60. You know, we're 40 players in. We've got 60 to go. Nothing left to do but to do it. Let's fucking do it. He's such a laid back guy. Oh, hey, man. Hey, yeah. Oh, man. Oh, you know. Here's the Millie Rock. This was a fun way to start. It was so funny. It was horrible looking, but it was hilarious. He's a team guy. Everybody's Millie Rocking. I'm going to start Millie Rocking. Corey's the man. I love Corey. The Millie Rocking. Whoa! I'll tell you what, we haven't seen that yet. Consistent, if nothing else. What is Millie rocking? In fact, you know what? Let's just look up his stats. Corey Lindsley. July 27th, 1991. He's 31 years of age. 6 foot 3, 301 pounds. Went to Ohio State. Got picked up in the 5th round of the 2014 draft with pick number 161 to the Packers. Stayed there for 7 years. And he's been at the Chargers since 2021. He's made his first Pro Bowl last year and uh, runs a, at, you know, nearly 300 pounds, 6 foot 3, runs a 503 40-yard dash, 27-inch vertical, 8 foot 11 on the broad jump, 36 reps on the bench, and almost as many reps on the Wonderlook, coming in with a score of 30. Three. March 17th, 2021, he signed a five-year, $62.5 million contract with the Chargers, making him the highest paid centre in the league. It just, it seems to be highest paid after highest paid after highest paid. And I'll tell you what, he most probably deserves it. Let's get into it. Corey Lindsley's chess isn't for his name or position. It means he's respected. But nothing shows peers respect. Does that mean captain? Back like being voted the best center on the top 100 for the second straight year. Oh, what have we here? 2011, 2012, 2013, 2014. What have we got? A 15 listing. No one in 16. Not a single center was listed in 16. 17. No one in 18. I, I find that really hard to believe, but might be right. 19, 20, 21, and 22. It wasn't the highest ever but uh if we're talking 2013 onwards he is the highest listed center for two years straight what an absolute legend what i think really makes a great center first and foremost you have to have the mental capacity to do that demanding part of the position centers are the quarterback of the offensive line lindsley gets an edge in the huddle when the rest of his teammates are facing in and focusing on justin herbert Lindsley is facing out, listening to Herbert while studying the defensive personnel substitutions and alignments. A lot of people, you know, they talk about the Wonder League and they talk about the quarterbacks. What about the centers? The center has to be able to call everything out. The amount of things he can see real quick. He's a really smart guy and he's the general out there. <laughs> well, well, I'm glad you're not the general, mate. We need the commands out a little bit more quickly, Joey. He lines up and he goes to work, and he's really one of the best to do it. Just having Corey, man, he's one, one of the best centers in this league, man. Y'all know that. You have to be somebody that can take charge of a group and lead them in the direction necessary. And then second, I mean, you're going to be asked to do a lot of things in most offenses. More and more teams are running these hybrid offenses that do a little bit of everything. Reach a two eye on a. Right, let's see where he moves. A zone run. We got it. Oh, he's blocking. He's blocking, all right. Block a defensive tackle one on one. Long enough for Herbert to go through four reads and get it cleanly to his check down. We got it. Get out in front of a screen for a touchdown. Oh, here we, we go. Got it. Here we go. Oh, lovely. Lovely work by the big man. Help sell a reverse to the left and then track down this linebacker. Watch him get out in space and accelerate. Get oh, the crap. He's got yeah, some good speed. Lindsley's got it. Tell you what, he transitions that 503 into the into the game like no, no one else I've seen thus far. And he's also got it. That it that every team needs. Corey Lynn. 
Tinsley. That's what this play is all about, just attitude. Gets his hands on you, it ain't a very comfortable feeling. I mean, his arms, they're almost as big as mine. <laughs> Back in college, I just remember him. Yeah, look, I'll be honest, mate. I ain't seen a guy bigger and wider than Mike Daniels thus far. I'm getting his be this strong when you turn on the film and watch him he just dominates guys one of the best to ever do it at that position i reckon i've made this call multiple times already but running behind a guy like that does it get any better just a great player in every facet well 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 that brings us to the end of another video thank you so much for watching guys i'm not going to take up any more of your time in the next video we're looking at max crosby the man who i actually created a highlight video of on my youtube channel saying max crosby summons the spirit bomb from raider stadium what a <laughs> what a moment it was it was something i well i just had to share um unfortunately that was uh, one of the videos that culminated it in my youtube channel being demonetized but we won't go there anyways guys thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one peace out